Hello there, Jenna Bosanko here and welcome to another video. I am right here at my favorite spot in the Gambia, Bakadaji Hotel. And today, to accompany me have a perfect video for you all is celebrity chef Dabajai. Hiya, good morning and um, welcome to Bakadaji Hotel. This is our, literally our number one seller here. It's called the uh, Grilled Seafood Bonanza. And it's a combination of um, crustaceans, mollusk, and fish. As young as you are and being a chef in the Gambia and working for a Gambian hotel, how's that experience? Um, it's a beautiful experience, mm -hmm. despite the challenges. Mm -hmm. um, I'm passionate about cooking, mm -hmm. and I love what I do. So, in as much as it's challenging, it's rewarding. I believe what makes Bakadaji special is our ability to provide a diverse menu, which I mentioned earlier. Also, we do work with local farmers. We try to get food as local as we can. Okay. We have chefs that are exposed, mm -hmm. so we're not limited to trying just Gambian food. Yeah. And we're constantly working on how to improve Gambian cuisine yeah. into a fine dining standard. So Bakadaji prides itself with diversity. How diverse is it? I would say it comes with the cuisine. Yeah. We're not just limited to Gambian cuisine. Yeah. We literally have dishes that are pastas, dishes that are from Italy, yeah. which, are pa which are pastas and pizzas. Mm -hmm. We do Gambian dish dishes such as domada, yasa. Yeah. So from the kitchen, we are now about to plate our special dish. And Chef, while you plate, I would love to know about the health aspects of this particular dish. Because as you can see, mm -hmm. in as much as this was fastly prepared, yeah. it's not fast food. Okay. It's fresh, cooked nicely as well, mm -hmm. with minimal oil as much as I could. In as much as I use some butter, mm -hmm. as you can see, it has been drained off. Okay. The so nothing comes out. as greasy, um, greasy or anything yeah. like that. Definitely not. So as the youngest chef, you actually drew my attention to the fact that you're the youngest chef in the kitchen. And if you know me, you know anything that has to do with young people, I'm interested. So what are those tips out there for, you know, younger individuals watching you out there as to how to become the amazing chef that you are in the midst of the older ones? I would say, Study mm -hmm. as much as you can. Right. Never limit yourself to studying. Mm -hmm. um, if I walk into a kitchen, I would always act like I don't even know how to chop an onion right. until I get challenged and then I have to prove myself. Nice. I never close up myself to learning new things. Mm -hmm. I'm constantly developing myself personally. And I'm also looking forward to um, trying the pizza menu where I can come up with you my own sure. pizza. <laughs> that is quite exciting. I'm looking forward to that. So um, that is all we have time for. See you on our another video and keep visiting Pakadaji Hotel. Thank you for watching.